Tesla has officially confirmed two massive updates about its long-awaited affordable model, and trust me, this one's going to shake the entire auto industry. Welcome to Tech Drive, where we dig deep into the stories that shape the future of mobility. Before we jump in, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and join the family, because what's coming next will absolutely blow your mind. So here's the deal. Earlier today, Tesla officially listed its long-rumored affordable model on its website. But here's the twist, it's not called Model Q as many fans expected. For now, Tesla simply refers to it as, the affordable model. And that's not all, Tesla also confirmed that pre-orders will open soon for this model, which insiders still call Model 2. The official starting price? Just $15,990 for the base version. Yes, under $16,000 for a Tesla. Of course, if you want the long-range or performance versions, you'll pay a bit more, but Elon Musk has promised that every version will stay below $20,000. Now, before you rush to your laptop, hold on, you can't pre-order just yet. Tesla's pre-order window opens on November 6th, and the first batch will be limited to around 10,000 units only. Once that number is reached, the order portal will shut down, without warning. Even more interesting, Tesla will apply specific eligibility rules. Pre-orders might be limited based on region, income level, and a few other conditions. So only a selected number of people will get their hands on the first batch. And now the big question, how will the pre-order process actually work? What will this mysterious new Model 2 look like, inside and out? Let's find out, because what we're seeing now is not just another EV launch, it's the beginning of something revolutionary. The truth we can't ignore is that affordable electric cars still haven't taken over the mass market. Why? Because there's still no solid proof that an average buyer can get an EV that's affordable, reliable, and truly practical enough to replace a gasoline car. Most people simply can't spend $40,000 on an electric car that travels short distances or feels stripped of basic tech. Sure, tech lovers and wealthier buyers might buy one, but for ordinary families, it's not realistic. That's why Tesla's new model could change everything. Many leaks and reports have already suggested jaw-dropping details. Some sources claim the Model 2 could start under $15,000, and a few even whisper about a price close to $10,000. There are also live stream clips showing prototypes being tested in Texas, with Tesla confirming that the real starting price will be $15,990 after incentives. Now remember, affordable doesn't mean cheap or low quality. According to internal leaks, the first batch of Model 2s has already entered small-scale production, roughly 10,000 units expected to debut at Tesla's grand event this November. And the market went crazy. Because this isn't just about a low price, it's about what that price represents. A massive shift in Tesla's long-term vision, from high-end luxury to mass-market dominance. For years, cars like the Chevy Bolt and Nissan Leaf have tried to fill the affordable EV segment, but even at $30,000, they couldn't convince most buyers. Now comes Tesla with a promise of $15,990, a sleek design, cutting-edge software, and the performance of a true Tesla. Musk himself has repeated this figure multiple times. He said Tesla is working to make a car that costs like ten dollars or $20,000 while still being world-class. Skeptics point out that Musk often misses timelines, and yes, that's fair. But with Model 2, the optimism feels different. Why? Because nearly all of the Model 2's core tech already exists. Tesla is reusing technology from the Model 3 and Model Y, from the drivetrain, LFP battery pack, and autopilot system, to the software platform and unboxed manufacturing process powered by the Gigapress system. This means faster production, lower costs, and fewer supply chain dependencies. Tesla's edge has always been its ability to build in-house. Unlike other automakers, Tesla doesn't depend heavily on external suppliers. It designs and produces almost every major component internally, batteries, control systems, and even AI chips. That's how the Model 2 could cost around $10,000 to build, yet still sell profitably for about $15,990, a stunning feat that only Tesla can pull off. From engineering talent to advanced AI-based manufacturing, Tesla's internal teams are considered world-class. 
This deep integration means Musk can finally deliver a car that's truly for everyone. Now, about the design. Contrary to earlier rumors, Model 2 won't debut as a hatchback. Instead, it's evolving into a compact crossover, clean, minimalist, and unmistakably Tesla. The design language follows the company's simplicity done right philosophy, smooth curves, aerodynamic lines, and signature LED accents. It's about 20% smaller than the Model 3, and that compactness helps reduce cost and weight. Expect Tesla's signature continuous light bar, streamlined wheels, and a rear look inspired by the Model 3, but more youthful and urban. Inside, the focus is practicality and efficiency. The cabin is cozy but designed for five passengers, with every inch optimized for space and cost efficiency. You won't find luxury grade leather or wood trims, instead, Tesla uses durable and sustainable materials. A 12 inch center screen replaces the larger 15 inch one found in the Model 3. Seats are simpler, the materials more economical, but everything still feels intelligently designed. It's not built to show off, it's built to make EVs accessible to millions. Of course, not everyone will love the minimalist vibe. Some might complain about missing features like rear screens, ambient lighting, or physical buttons. But Tesla's software-first approach means you'll get regular over-the-air updates, just like on other Tesla models. Before we go deeper, if you're excited about this and want to be part of the future of electric mobility, make sure to smash that subscribe button right now, because we'll bring you every new leak and update the moment it drops. Now, here's where it gets spicy, the tech inside the Model 2 could rewrite EV history. Tesla plans to introduce a new 48-volt low-voltage electrical system, making the car more efficient and lightweight. And alongside that, there's a whisper about something even more shocking, the long-teased aluminum-ion battery may finally be here. This could be the turning point that makes every other affordable EV instantly obsolete. Let's break it down. Aluminum-ion batteries work similarly to lithium-ion, but instead of lithium, they use aluminum ions, which carry three positive charges instead of one. That means they can move more energy per ion, offering potentially much higher energy density. In theory, that could mean ranges beyond 700 miles, even whispers close to 1,000. Now, imagine a $15,000 Tesla that can travel 600 to 700 miles on a single charge. That's not evolution, that's revolution. Compare that to today's Model Y long range, about 330 miles max, or budget Chinese EVs that barely cross 200 miles. If Tesla pulls this off, the gap becomes a canyon. Even if we scale down lab results to real-world numbers, aluminum ion tech could double current energy density from 200 WH slash kg to 700 WH slash kg. That's enough to completely redefine what long range means for EVs. Fast charging is another huge plus. Lab tests suggest 80% charge in 10 minutes, and even in real conditions, 20 minutes looks possible, way faster than current lithium or LFP batteries. Imagine grabbing a coffee while your car recharges most of its range. That's how you win over skeptical drivers. Safety also matters. LFP batteries are known for stability, and aluminum ion could go even further, less fire risk, less degradation, and better recycling potential. But of course, it's still in early testing, so we'll have to see how it performs on the road. Tesla's choice now is strategic. Go with safe, proven LFP cells, cheap but limited range, or gamble on aluminum ion, which could change everything but comes with more risk. Remember, the battery makes up 30 to 40% of an EV's cost, so whichever chemistry Tesla chooses will define how affordable the Model 2 really becomes. Realistically, Tesla's baseline is a 53 kilowatt hour pack giving about 250 miles of range. That's practical and enough for daily use. But if aluminum ion scales, that same pack could push past 600 miles without changing size. It's the difference between a commuter car and a true freedom machine. Tesla's engineering team is known for finding clever pack-level efficiencies, squeezing every bit of power from new cells. 
Even if 700 WH slash KG never fully reaches production, Tesla could still deliver a pack far denser than current LFPs. And when that happens, the Model 2 won't just be an affordable car, it'll be the car that finally breaks the EV barrier for the entire world. But Tesla needs to communicate clearly. If they promise affordability without transparency on range and charging, they risk losing trust. However, if they show proof, real specs, real testing, then this car could be the true people's EV that Elon Musk promised years ago. So here's the question we leave you with, when it comes to an affordable electric car like the Model 2. What matters more to you personally, safety or driving range? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like this video, share it, and of course, subscribe to Tech Drive for the next breaking Tesla update, coming in just two days. We've got tons of new content lined up, from the latest Tesla EV news to exclusive insights about the Tesla bot and next-gen battery tech. Stay tuned, because the electric future is moving faster than ever. Until next time, this is Tech Drive, and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, and drive smart.